we have 22 bookmark orders. 50 magnetized mirror where I was like, that's what my face looks like up close. I had a whole dang nose job to fix that and it's still there. You made this mess and left me with the pieces. Now I wanna burn all the bridges between us. go as planned if you can't tell you know what i've been craving a nice margarita like one that i make i make nice because i don't want it to taste like pure sugar i also thought it was going to be really nice out there and i was going to sit outside and make stuff which i honestly would not have had time to do that anyway so i guess it's okay it didn't work out but it's it's rainy i'm a little nervous we have photos tomorrow which is why I've been sitting outside for like a tiny bit. And I'm nervous that it's not gonna be a sunny day and they're outdoor photos. Speaking of which, I need to finish, I need to pay the other half now. I wanna say I only pay 25% down. So we still probably owe like 75 bucks. It's just a mini photo shoot and so it's truly only 15 minutes long. Um, which, I do we really need more than 15 minutes of photos? Probably not. I really need that vacuum not to run out of battery. Because one, he will lose it. He will absolutely lose his shit. But two, I <laughs> cut his hair right before I would put him down for a nap. And just trust me, if I would have turned that vacuum on, I wouldn't have gotten even the hour that I got. He cannot like self-regulate he's he's two like i'm not expecting him to but specifically after like if i don't let him vacuum or if the vacuum runs out of battery he will not get over that for a very long time and so i've just been sitting in here in complete filth but he's up now which is why i am like cleaning mode and he's cleaning because I knew I had to get the vacuum out. I'm like, I might as well let him do a little vacuuming. By a little, I mean he is going to let that battery completely go dead. And then I will just have to deal with the consequences. <laughs> Alright, um... I want to make sure that he's not vacuuming up the kitties. He's not. Wonderful. Get you a little tiny bit away from his uh, vacuuming. Look at this foundation. This is from, so I went to do a photo tomorrow and I realized I don't own, I own one, a singular foundation, which bravo to me because at one point in my life I probably had like 20, um, but I only own one foundation and it was for my wedding and I was like 10 shades darker and so I can't wear that and like I want to look nice in the photos so I went to Dillard's which is the only place that could color match me because we, we actually are getting a Sephora but it's not coming in for like 11 days from now um or I would have just went there but we have Dillard's which is like great um I would have went to the drugstore I just I suck at color matching so bad so I went to Dillard's and I had the lady color match me and I think she did a really good job she picked out if I would have seen that I'd been like that is way too dark but it's perfect so here's props to um the ladies at the beauty counters they know what they're doing I just don't love talking to people and like asking for help half the time. Um, but with this one, I was like, just help, please help me. Um, but I was gonna show you what I got. So I wanted, I asked her, I was like, I need something that's hydrating because my skin's super dry uh, from Accutane and I need sunscreen because I want it to be dual purpose. And if it could be skincare, um, more skincare focused, that's even, whoa, I don't have boobs, but 
I do today. Um, if it's skin, more like skincare, like that's what I want. And I don't want it full coverage. Like I just want something really lightweight, but can cover like my redness. Um, because you know, I'm patchy and I have melasma. So she said, I got you. This skin feels good. This is a, sun, a 23 SPF sunscreen, hydrating skin tint, healthy glow. And like everyone, that there are two, everyone, there are two girls um, working there. One was a lawn comb rep and the other was like the one that like works there all the time. And they both said, I don't consider this actually makeup. This is like skincare to us. So I'm like, put it on me. And she did. And honestly, it looked awful um, because the mirror they had was one of those like light up, like 50 magnetized mirror where I was just like, that's what my face looks like up close. Um, you know, feeling super ugly. But I was like, I don't have any other options. So wrap it up. <laughs> and yeah, here it is. So I'm in the color Cool Porcelain. It's the second lightest shade. And honestly, and she said this. She's like, I'm wearing it now. She's like, it will not look that great when you first put it on. And I thought when she was saying that, I'm like, oh, of course, this is, seems very gimmicky. Um, it's not going to look good when you first put it on. <laughs> Uh, it was like it will melt into your skin later on and she was right it did and I feel like really nice it's weird looking at my face like it looks like like I'm just not used to I guess wearing makeup anymore but um I like it a lot so I'm excited it was $39 <laughs> which you know has me gagging a little but I think we're I hope we're gonna get paid today so we should be okay with that. And that was the only, she tried selling, I almost gave in. I was like, I could not come home right now with like $60 of makeup. Um, she tried getting me to buy the like ultra hydrating concealer and I wanted to, I wanted to. Uh, but we need to get a few more bookmark sales in to get that. No, honestly, I was thinking in my head, I'm like, how many bookmarks do I have to sell <laughs> to buy this right now? But I'm like, is it worth it? I'm not gonna wear it that often and so I, You'll be proud. I said no. Thank you. But oh my gosh, look at how cute this shirt is. This is from American Eagle. It's so lightweight, gauzy. Like I'm in 77 degree weather and it feels good to have on. And it, I hate wearing pink, and but I love the color pink. And so if I see something like that's really cute, I don't care if I look bad, if my outfit's cute. That's how I feel in this. I think this is the most adorable little outfit. I have, this is a two set. Um, I just feel so summery and I even have my matching silicone wedding band and yeah. Oh, well the point of me I wasn't just showing off my outfit. Um, $14.99 or $15.99. One of those two from American Eagle right now. Randy and I, we went in to get him a pair of shorts for our photos and I saw this I honestly thought it was going to be 30 and I bought it anyways. And then they went up to the cash register and he rang it up as $15.99 and I was like, I looked at Randy and I was like, I need to go get another one. And so I got a blue one too. <laughs> They're so cute. Go to American Eagle, see if they have them and buy them. You will not regret that. I, this is the second time I've worn this this week. So if you are ever near me, um, you're probably going to see me in this outfit. <sighs> That's all for the haul. I did pack up a bunch of orders. Again, I ran out. Let me go check on this baby real quick. He's good. Um, I ran out of packaging. I told you guys yesterday, I think I have another day left of packing um, supplies. I did not. So I packed, I have eight orders ready to go um, because that's the amount of boxes I had left. And so I checked. My other ones are coming tomorrow. It's what it says. Um, Amazon's usually pretty good about getting that in, but that's okay because weekends, I don't think count in the processing time. And so I'm kind of debating. I think I should probably just put another order in uh, because we went through the, the last box order within a week. And I also need stickers. And I I need to go just go through my inventory because I'm running low on a lot of stuff. And I don't think of the things that I pack my orders in, in my brain when I'm deciding what do I need to order this week. Um, so I just need to order more stickers, more tissue paper, more boxes. And I'm so upset my, uh, eye pins that I love. You know how many eye pin brands I've been through? So many. 
Do you know me? I have loved just one and it's out of stock. And I don't know how many I have left. I need to go through, I have so many beads and supplies that I don't have enough room to put them. And so I have a lot of them just stuffed into some bins. And I need to actually go through those bins now and count how many I have and see. I need to start ordering more to try to find a brand I like. The good thing with Amazon is like a lot of it's prime and I can just send it back. It's just like really annoying, right? So we need to do that this weekend. And then I need to make more stock because I made... 10 strawberry charms yesterday and half of them are gone already and I just got a bunch of new orders in and I have a feeling that I'm definitely gonna need new strawberries tonight and a few other items I'm starting to like run out like I'm discontinuing pieces because I just um, I can't get some of the charms anymore and I haven't started building my new ones so I need to start oh no I haven't cleaned the hair up yet he's about lose his mind okay <laughs> I'm gonna go um I <laughs> have to go grocery shopping anyway so I will see you tomorrow we're gonna start doing like inventory together thank you so much have a good day and see you then <laughs> good morning <laughs> we have family photos and so I'm gonna do a get ready with me we're starting out I just washed my face for the second time in about five minutes and by face this area because I had already started sweating. Um, off to a good start. It's just gonna happen, I just need to let it be. And now we're gonna go in with Elemis Superfood. I've not used this yet, this is Glow Priming Moisturizer. Just give me some glow, obviously, and then to prime my makeup. Hair's already done, um, it's just gonna be. <laughs> Ooh, that is glowy. Um, again, we are, I showed you guys this yesterday, going in with Lancome Hydrating Skin Tint Healthy Glow is the name of it. And mine's in the color 10 Cool Porcelain. I don't know why. I didn't expect, like, I just wanted color match yesterday. And she went on a full makeup uh, face for me, which I did not want because it grosses me out. It grosses me out so much of brushes being used and like she came at me with that brush the one she used it was so dirty <laughs> and all I could think of is I'm getting so much bacteria on my face um but I, I went through it she was very very nice and I was like I'm not gonna I'm not gonna say like oh don't touch me <laughs> so I let her do it and she caked that on yesterday so I'm not gonna do that but I did like the brush she used um just the way my face looked after the fact like after after um look really nice mm, that is a nice color this is not a makeup tutorial so <laughs> i don't know why i'm acting like it is next we're gonna go and this is from my wedding makeup this is the jouer essential high coverage liquid concealer we just need a tiny bit on my eyes Yeah, that's good. That blends in actually pretty well. I know I bought this originally to be like brightening, like a lighter color, but matching's fine too. <laughs> I really did like the concealer she used yesterday though. If I become rich in the near future, I'm gonna go buy that. I also really wanna buy a pair of shoes. So like that's step one. And second step is that concealer. And then a tiny bit here. I have a lot of like, <laughs> A lot. I have um, really thin skin right here and so like my nose there's a bone that's like popping out is always really red right in this area fun fact I had surgery to fix that and it did not get fixed <laughs> do you see it like that was a, <laughs> I had a whole dang nose job to fix that and it's still there my nose still looks the same <laughs> So money wasted, money wasted. And then I think next, I'm not gonna go full in with anything else. I think I'm just gonna do my, oh, you're just getting my favorites right now. I'm gonna go in with my Drunk Elephant Rosy Drops. Love these, oh, I love them. On show days, I'm wearing this and then this. And then this is the Glow Sunscreen by Supergoop. It is a sunscreen. You're technically supposed to use it all over, but I just use it as a highlighter. Um, it's so pretty. I have the mini version because I got a little mini sampler packed of like sunscreen. So I'm like, I need all the sunscreen I can get right now with like Accutane. 
and um, I 100% I will buy the full version when this runs out. Um, but because I'm using it as highlighter, it's gonna take a while. I have by Mario, Makeup by Mario. Oh, this is gonna be too dark. Maybe if I just do a tiny bit on my foundation brush. Hmm. Yeah, that's okay. It's photos, you wanna, you probably can't even see it on camera. I don't know if you can see a difference, but it's just a very light mix. Good, okay. But it's so pretty. I love the rosy drops, definitely buy them. Definitely buy them. It's a top five essential. We're just going light and airy. And then lastly, I say lastly, I'm also gonna do mascara. Um, we're gonna put this on and then we'll do mascara. Oh, 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 so pretty, so pretty. Actually, I actually think I'm gonna have to use my foundation brush to Put that down. Put a little much on. Put a little much on. Do you see how glowy that is? Oh, it's so pretty. We are glowing. We are glowing. Okay, and lastly, the eyebrows and eyes. For the eyebrows, I'm going in with this little sample size of the Fluff Up Brow Wax by Benefit. I love their stuff. This is a top five as well. So what we're gonna do is put one coat on, do the other, and then we're gonna go back because you have to give the wax a little bit of time to stiffen. So you can really get those babies up there. My favorite mascara is a Voluminous Butterfly Sculpt. Okay, I'm gonna put this on and I'll be back. My, I don't have enough uh, room right now on my memory card. <laughs> Need to upload a video. Look at that mascara. That's so, I forgot how much I loved it. Okay, now on to the hair. So before, <laughs> so it feels like the Anne Hathaway, ladies and gentlemen, we have a princess. I got this dress from Goodwill. I'll give you a full body here in a minute, but um, I did have to wipe off a ton of upper lip sweat, so I'm hoping my makeup doesn't look like terrible there. I think it's fine. Uh, we have to go though, so <laughs> no type of touch ups. My hair, I just curled it and then put it into a uh, half pony and then put my little bow in I got from TJ Maxx and we are ready. Let me show you, show you the full body. It's just this cute little mini dress from American Eagle. I also need to, I think I probably need to put some cup liners in here because that's looking a little floppy. <laughs> I'm gonna finish getting ready and then I'll meet you guys back to do hopefully packing orders. We have 18 orders that came in the last 24 hours and I'm waiting for my boxes. So hopefully they come in while we're out and about. But I'll check in a little bit later. Stop, we have 22 bookmark orders to go. I think in total, like between the last 14 hours, we sold like 30 something bookmarks. I need to get on making more, which is not a bad problem to have. I made 10 last night and they are all gone. So yeah, we have this big bag. I'm about to take it to the post office. So it's just nice getting that off. Like I know I don't have to do it within a day, but it, it makes my stress less if I just get it done daily. And um, and while we're writing, again, this like mass of orders, and I say mass, like for me, a mass of orders, um, I just want to get them out and then I can relax. So yeah, we're good. We just, we obviously, I got my box order in um, right after we got back from photos. And so I, sorry I did not film it, but I just like, I needed to get it all done. And I wanted to get to the post office before two and it's 140 now. And this took me like an hour and a half to pack up everything. So, um, yeah, I did have to order another like uh, shipment of boxes, but we should be good for the next like couple days. I may hopefully. And then I just ran out of stickers. I ran out my last one. So there's some weird ones going on here. Like sometimes 
because I've told you guys this, like I buy a variety mystery pack and so I never know what they're gonna get. And sometimes they're really cute and sometimes they're really weird. And so when I see like a really weird one, I push it off and like grab a different one. Normally whatever I like randomly grab, I put in, but again, sometimes I'm just like, this feels off. Um, and I'm gonna put that one to the back. And I unfortunately had to use those back stickers. And what's really funny is that um, I got on my TikTok yesterday and realized I had been tagged in two unboxing videos. Just, I've never been tagged in an unboxing video. And I had two, and I'm like, as they were opening them, my stress levels was like, what kind of weird stickers are they about to pull out for people? <laughs> and uh, thankfully, there was only one weird one out of those two and it wasn't like real weird. So I just like, I haven't, I didn't even think of that being a thing of, um, what if someone unboxes this online? And like, obviously like if it was something that it's, um, like profanity or like insensitive or like anything where it's just like politically incorrect, I would, I would just throw that away. But like some of them are just like, pandas wearing bathing suits just just random random ones like today i had a pack one that said uh hoover dam um and i'm like oh hopefully this person has been there or wants to go there you know they're just they're just weird so yeah i was just hoping one of those weren't gonna like pop up <laughs> okay i'm gonna um take this to the post office and then i'll be back and we gotta make some bookmarks actually i need to eat lunch that's what i need to do so i will probably see you without makeup on next because I'm about to wash this off. Just making a TikTok about Sophie. Okay, that took entirely too long. But now I need to upload a TikTok video, a YouTube short, and an Instagram, which automatically posts to Facebook. And yeah, we are good to go. Just a little business insider tip that you should already know. Assume that someone's going to make a packing video whenever you pack things, right? That's a good way to not be nervous when they're unpacking it. I mean, my packing is great. Like, it's, it's great. Um, and the girls that did it, oh my gosh. If only I had a tenth of, like, creativity that they have and like I see people on TikTok have with their videos like I I don't have that I have never had that even my editing I do like extremely basic things it used to be better um but I forgot all the tricks and when you like it's not when you forget it and you're out of it for a while you don't remember those things like you just don't so um maybe I could take some kind of online class or something I hear um uh, Monica I watch her videos a lot. She does sponsorships with, what is that company? Skillshare um, and other YouTubers that I like watch too. I've, I've heard of Skillshare many, many times. Um, maybe I should actually take one of those classes though. I need to figure out how much it is a month. That might be worth doing. So I'm gonna end the vlog here. I'm gonna go change, take my makeup off. I did enough TikToks to get through two TikToks. <laughs> I just don't want to overload it in like this look, you know? Um, because that's just not, people would think that I only wear this all the time. So we're gonna get out of it. And, um, and then I'm gonna do, I'll probably film, I won't film my uh, making uh, bookmarks tonight, uh, but I will probably film it tomorrow. Just kidding, it's Asher's birthday. I'll bring you along for some birthday festivities too, maybe. Um, so thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe if you're not already, and I will see you very soon in another video within like the next week is the goal. So, audience, bye.